Hey guys, uh, just wanted to do a quick channel update. Stick around. Hello YouTube and hello Google Plus people. Hey, I just wanted to do a quick channel update. Um, never really done a channel update before, but I just wanted to give you a guy, uh, give you guys an idea of what's coming up uh, on my channel. Um, recently, I uh, just booked a flight to uh, Oklahoma, and I'm flying out there on Christmas evening, and I'm staying out there for a couple weeks. And my uncle uh, lives out there, and my father's going with me, and it's his brother. And uh, we're going to do quite a bit of waterfowl hunting. And um, may not do any hunting here in Maryland. My this cousin year. Uh, uh, might just is a um, cattle farmer. And he lives out there, and we hunt his property. And um, so we're going he has a lot of uh, different ponds that we hunt. And I've hunted out there in past years and been very successful. I'm more of a goose hunter than I am a duck hunter. Um, and, you know, there's plenty of geese out there. They're huge flocks, hard for them, uh, you know, hard to convince some, just a couple birds to come in and out uh, of some huge flocks. And we don't like shooting into the huge flocks either. Um, you know, but the ducks out there, a uh, lot, lot of ducks. Um, so it's kind of a, a different pace uh, to go um, to be out there duck hunting, and uh, uh, you know, in Maryland, if uh, you know, we set up, I set up for goose hunting mainly, and uh, if we happen to have some ducks swirl in or we're near a pond, um, you know, we might see a few ducks early morning, and we'll take a shot at them. But uh, we, we we're mainly a goose hunter, so. It's always fun to go out there and uh, get some duck hunting. So I'm going to be out there for two weeks. I'm taking the camera and uh, some tripods and things like that. There's going to be some logistics to work out uh, at the blinds. There, there's several different blinds that my uncle built out there. But, uh, you know, uh, my channel is Waterfowler2012 and um, I have very limited uh, waterfowl videos um on my channel and that's something that is my passion and i plan on uh putting some of those videos up so all my prepper folks uh you know if you're not interested in those videos i understand uh, obviously you don't need to watch them um but i can tell you that uh, they're going to be very entertaining i'm sure so uh, you know, it's funny, you see this Duck Dynasty show with these Robertsons, and they actually used to have their own show on the hunting network, uh, the Outdoor Life Network, or one of the networks, uh, before they were on A&E, and they actually had a pretty decent show at one point that was strictly duck hunting, um, you know, none of this family stuff and basketball games and the silly stuff that's scripted for them now. They actually did have a pretty good hunting show at one point. And we always joked around if we were going to have our own hunting show, it would have to be on HBO or Cinemax or Showtime. Um, but we could have a hunting show. So it's a little raw. It's going to be a little uh, off the cuff, uh, not scripted. And hopefully I can figure out logistics of filming and still getting some shots. Uh, you know of, of birds that come in hopefully I don't know how I'm gonna make it work but uh, I'll figure it out some tripods and different things so I'm looking forward to that I'm looking forward to the challenge of filming it I'm looking forward to uh, hunting again I haven't hunted in two years uh, just due to due to some of the health issues I've had with uh, foot surgeries and and uh, the hunting out there is uh, a lot easier than it is here in Maryland uh, can drive right up to all the blinds um, drop off all of our gear or decoys uh, and my uncle does most of the setup a lot of the setup because uh, um, some of it's in ponds we're not taking waders and things of that nature but anyway it, it's it should be a good time so even if you're not into the hunting videos maybe you should click on one or two when I get them posted a couple other things I've been thinking about um, is looking here on my phone I have a list of videos I'm actually going to do a video on deodorant um, and I'm thinking about like a long-term SHTF type situation and I have a couple of deodorants that I've been uh, messing around with that I've tested probably over six or eight months 
and uh, it's not something you're going to find at a CVS or Walgreens or Walmart um, but I've uh, really put these things to the test especially in the summertime um, so you know if a 300 pound guy can wear deodorant and be happy with it I can assure you that a lot of other guys out there um, that uh, don't sweat as profusely as I do on a, a hot hum humid day here in August um, so anyway I'm gonna do a deodorant video um, also all the hate on Google here lately I've actually invested in a product, uh, the Google Chromecast, um, and that is a device that you stick into your HDMI uh, connector on the back of your TV, and then you can um, watch YouTube videos on your 55-inch television. Um, and I actually just bought a new router, and I'm having problems connecting with it, but my old router worked pretty well, um, and <clears throat> so. I'm not going to get into the details of that, but I want to do a Chromecast video. I watch a lot of YouTube videos, and I was watching a lot of them on my phone, um, and even on a laptop, uh, watching them, um, you know, if you can watch them on your own television, man, it just, it's great. I love it, and it's a real great way to watch videos, and it's $35, and it's a pretty good product, so uh, I'm going to do a review on the Chromecast coming up. And um, I'm also want to do a video on leadership in a SHTF situation, pros and cons of it, um, and that's basically my list that I have uh, for ideas so far. So that's kind of what's going to be coming down the pike. I don't know if those videos are going to be before Christmas, um, if I have time. Um, my son is almost seven months old now and um, he has not slept through the night yet um, so me and mom um, have really had been uh, have been challenged with his sleeping um, more her than I because she's still breastfeeding um, but uh, it's still been really tough um, so our schedules have been uh, pretty hectic with uh, trying to get him to sleep He's sleep training us very well, and we're trying to sleep train him. So, um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to give you an idea of what's going on. Um, if you have any questions, comments, uh, please just, you know, ideas, throw them out there. Um, but definitely look for some uh, waterfowl hunting videos, the deodorant video, the Chromecast video, a leadership in the SHTF video, and I thought I had a couple more jotted down on paper, but I didn't put them in my phone, so I don't know. As video ideas come in my head, I try to jot them down so I remember to uh, at least think about them, putting them on here. Maybe I'll never upload them, um, but at least I get them off my chest, and sometimes it's enough to make a video even though I don't upload it. So that's it guys I hope everybody has a great Thanksgiving a safe Thanksgiving it looks like some of the weather between the Midwest over to the East Coast and the Northeast uh, could get a little hairy so everybody be careful out there and uh, as always if you're not into preparedness you're preparing to fail thanks for your time guys mm -hmm.